Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of Dragon's Dogma 2. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we are going to get this side quest done for the Arbor Heart. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Sure, let's follow you, I guess. Riku and patient. I ought to act a little more cheery. Much to hope for a helping hand, but I've much to do yet. <coughs> Would that I could spend all my day. I'm trained for this. All knowledge of this, God's way stems from the Forbidden Magic Research Laboratory, which can be found here in the Tal. However, you would do well to first travel to the Altar of the Tal Coast and seek a man named Ambrosius. For as a researcher of this laboratory, he will doubtless be able to answer many of your questions. Follow me! Bak Batal, capital of Batal. Coolio. I don't know a town until you've met its people. Look around if you must, but be sure to buy aught. Back Batal is not a friendly place for pawns. Each gaze we encounter feels more unjustly vicious than the last. Take heart. Good. We're here. Yeah. More than my life's worth, this. Let's talk to this guy. Work's work, no matter how dull it might be. This lady? Aye. What brings you to Brocker's Smithy? Looking for scale cinder, are we? Well, you're in a look. Our forge is flit. Oh, tis at an elf's behest, you say? I'm afraid that changes things a wee bit. Elves and dwarves don't get along, see? Brocker won't want to help you. Unless you were to offer him aught he couldn't resist. Listen, I happen to know there's one bit of elven culture no dwarf can turn their nose up at. All elven fares, bland as grass. All of it. That is, save this singularly flavoursome dish, Nutriab. Course, no dwarf would openly admit to having a taste for it. But the fact of the matter is, the mere smell of that dish has dwarves foaming at the maw. Don't believe me? Bring a bowl of it to Brocker. You'll soon see. Where the hell am so I supposed to get that? Or grant us some guefenture in exchange for Nutriab. Shall we inform Miss Darren of this, Master? Follow me, Master, a few words. I'll bring you to the one you seek. We're in your hand, sir. Much obliged. Peaceful as ever. Pray, follow me. You're gonna bring me all the way to where I think you're gonna bring me. No, I guess still in town. Am I shedding? Hmm, must be my winter coat growing in. Oi, what's your problem? Walking about with pawns in tow, I mislike that. You from Vermont? <laughs> Bet you're as prejudiced as the rest of your lot. 
Well, got something you want to say, eh? Save it. You're not welcome here. Suppose you didn't know, but we don't allow Vermundi and scum in this tavern. But I've got a heart of gold, me. I'll give you a chance to redeem yourself. All you've got to do is prove your mettle against these sods alone, that is. If you're bested, then we'll take all you've got. It's only fair, ain't it? Put your back into it! I shan't let you get away. Well now, quite the brawl we're having here. But I must say, these odds are rather craven. Did you leave your honor at the door? And who are you supposed to be? You a friend of this one? Nay, I'm a sellsword. Coin is my only ally. Tis not my conscience that called me here. No, oh, no. I simply cannot stomach acts of cowardice. Is there even one among you with the grit for a proper duel, one on one? What'd be in it for us, eh? The fact that I'd refrain from breaking your jaw. Hmm, that's not quite the reaction I was hoping for. Mayhap you know not my face. How about my name then? Ragnar. Ragnar? You're him. From the Scarlet Reigns and the battle for Jeremiah? Well, tis clear you're a man best not crossed. But I trust you'll have no complaints so long as there's only one of us. Aye? Oi, bring it out! Where's that reprobate gotten off to? We'll see if you can escape me a second time. time to Show them your metal! <laughs> Ouch. Get up. I... I don't believe it. You're a bloody menace, you are. Come on, you lot. We're leaving. Fine work, that was. Pray, save your thanks. I've no need of it. After all, judging by the skill with which you won that duel just now, I dare say you'd have bested those louts even if I hadn't intervened. I suppose that coward knew he was no match for you in a fair fight, so he had that beast take the beating for him. At any rate, tis safe to say you've piqued my interest. I hope our paths cross again someday. Of course, I can't promise I'll be as amicable then. As a sellsword, tis my policy to let my employer decide friend from foe. I'm sure you understand. Till next time. So Ragnar is no ordinary man, that much is certain. Ah, uh, yes. You're the one who aided us in storming the Coral Snake's hideout. I've been questioning Hugo, the bandit we took into custody, but he refuses to answer any of my questions. In fact, he's hardly said a word. The lad's been sent back to his cell for now, but perhaps I could trouble you to talk with him. I seem to recall that he recognized you. Are you acquainted? At any rate, methinks you might have more success loosening his lips than I. Follow me, if you would. Dude, everybody is talking to me in this town. It's crazy. An ox cart ought to make our journey easier. One hopes these carts offer comfort commensurate to their costs. We have arrived. Huh? What in the... Where did you come from? Did Clark send you? Oh no, he did, didn't he? I'm sorry. I I'm really, truly very sorry. I haven't slept a wink, I swear it. Well, I suppose I might have fallen asleep once or twice, but it isn't as if I've been lazing about. I simply haven't been able to devise any good ideas. 
I tell you, this arrangement has been an encumbrance on my mind from the very beginning. While I am glad that the old man appreciated my talents enough to commission me, it doesn't change the facts. I can only depict subjects that I've seen with my own two eyes, which makes things rather difficult, given the task at hand. Say, you appear a rather strapping sort. Would you be persuaded to bring me to a griffin? It will be well worth any trouble. Clark shall pay handsomely to see this done, and you'd be doing me a great boon besides. I've heard aught of a griffin's nesting place. I shall await you there. Do keep in mind, however, that you must needs drag the battle out if I am to complete my sketch. Of course, I, I could look as long as I pleased if you were to petrify the beast. Petrify? How would I petrify it? Indeed. A beast frozen in place would be much more easily drawn. Tis said that a famed sculptor of Eld used a Medusa's severed head to petrify her subjects before sketching them. Of course, I wouldn't presume to demand aught so legendary of you, Arisen. I only ask that you aid me in completing my sketch as best as you are able. Then I shall depart at once. Pray, meet me at the foot of the Guerco mountain range, east of the rest town. Then I suppose we should probably get a Medusa head. So we don't have a Medusa's head yet, but we did fight one at the beginning of the game. So there's got to be one around here eventually. We could go over here. But I think we should do this first and then out of the forest into the forge. Flickering shadows at I think is the main quest. We may do that. I don't even want to look at Spellbound. Might you consider lightening your pack, Master? If you've anything edible, I'll gladly lessen your burden. Sounds like Riku wants to eat my food. Are we going to the right place? I think so. Hopefully we are. I could die happy in a place like this, I could. I'm barely scraping by. Materials, eh? I shan't deny. They have their uses. Where are we going? Damn it, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, yeah, we're gonna have to turn around and go up this way. Admirable work, if I do say so myself. We got so much going on right now. But not at the expense of my duty. What's this? Okay. Whoa, that looks cool. I want to go over there. I'm really curious about that. That'd be a really cool screenshot, although you can't really see my face. So you're the one Benjamin sent to get the whelp to talk, eh? Well, go on then. Don't dawdle, and I'll thank you not to distract the jailers from their charge. Have no fear, master. I'll fare all right without you for a little while. It's not our place to hurry the Arisen. A 
My parents were killed by brigands. And I've no doubt I'd have followed them to an early grave if Lanzo hadn't taken me in. He made me a part of the Coral Snakes. Gave me a home, a life. I wanted to repay him however I could, so I did what he told me. I know it ain't right to steal, but I thought I could use all that gold of Filch to help someone, like Lanzo did for me. I didn't take it for myself, it was for the poor. I wanted to give people a chance to choose a better path in life. Instead of ending up like... like me. That's why I did the things I did. Understand. And I don't believe for a moment that Lanzo meant what he said to me in the hideout. Twas all an act. So if you're waiting for me to talk, cuz, don't hold your breath. That's why I did the things I... and I don't believe for a moment... Is there anything else I can do? <laughs> Forbidden Magic Research Lab. Yeah, I don't think I should be in here. I have a feeling that would make the guards mad. Do you want a way to release the whelp sooner? <laughs> Do you realize what you're asking? Well, there might be a way, only you didn't hear it from me. I've not the authority to promise such a favor, but that doesn't mean no one does. They had Jade, for instance. I reckon he could get the lad his freedom, if you made it worth his while. What jailer? I'm a tad preoccupied just now. Can't you see I'm on... This jailer? Aye, what can I do for you? Oh, you want the bandit whelp released, do you? I suppose I could consider it. Aye, being head jailer has its privileges. I could accommodate such a request if I were so inclined. Of course, you'd need to prove your integrity first. I can't go around unlocking cells for just anyone. Yeah, thousand gold, that's not bad. Aye, you've made your case well. I'll see to it that the request for the lad's release is put through. But you might have to be patient. One cannot rush these things. I think I need to refill my lantern. Oh yeah, near empty. That's why I did the things I and I don't believe for a So is he going to release him? I don't understand. Let's try waiting. Is there a bench or anything to wait at? Doesn't seem like there's a bench to wait. I want to open the door. That's why I did, and I don't believe for a moment that. 
That's why I don't believe for a moment. That's dumb. <laughs> it won't let me open the damn door. Open. Ha ha! It opens up these doors. Damn, that is a long ass way down. These damn sky cells, man. I'd be instant death if I jumped down there. What's gone wrong with the world? Oh shit! Okay, nope. That was bad. That was really bad. <laughs> uh, okay, I will be right back. I do not want the guards to attack me. <laughs> Sorry, everybody. See everybody in just a minute. We're back, and nobody's mad at us, thankfully. Let's see. That's why I did the things I did, and I don't believe for a moment. Well, let's go, since he's not talking to us, let's go see if we can't rest somewhere. For the day, I need to put things away anyways. These writings could be of import. Shall we take a closer look? Just need to find somewhere to rest. Gathering materials makes for dull work indeed. Here we go. Pilgrim's Inn. We'll put a waypoint right over here. I could probably make some new gear. But I think what I'm going to do is store all my stuff. And then I'm going to switch over to the Mystic Spirit. Spear or the magic spear. I don't remember exactly what it's called, but I'm going to switch over to that. Just walking through the tanning equipment. Leather working equipment or dye. I don't know if it's dye or um, salt water for leather work. Mayhap I could carry some things for you. Yeah, I'm running pretty slow. You I there. Have you a home in Batal? If not, well, look no further. As it so happens, I've one to sell. Now, I've noticed you tend to travel with pawns. A bold choice here in Batal, where they're ill-loved. So I thought you might prefer a home of your own to stay at, rather than a crowded inn. Well, what say you? Oh, uh... And no, I'm okay. Not feeling so keen, are you? Well, you'll not find a better deal elsewhere. Of that, I'm gonna. You know what? Uh, yes. My offer still stands. A wise decision, sir. Here you are, dear. Let's deposit some stuff real quick. We got so much fruit wine. We don't have so much fruit wine. I'm just saying we have so much in our inventory in general. I'm just commenting that there was fruit wine.
I'm going to sell those uh, spits or spites. I'll sell that too. No, I don't want that ring. Can we go sell some stuff real quick? And then we'll rest. Oh my goodness. About ran right off of there. Perhaps I to hire on someone new. No, our house isn't that far. It's like in between this area and like the main area of Batal. So let's get rid of this. And I guess we'll go over. Oh, there's two different ends but we'll go over here I've all I need right Can't here work as late Would as I could shoot my oh, like well met is this a challenge arisen to see who can keep pace let's it is. endeavor to keep up though we are me I now this hardly bears saying but don't you Ring of Disfavor. Sell that too. Pretty much got all our money back. Dare try to take anything without paying for it first. I'm not going to bother with that just yet. Many thanks. Just because Your we're going to be switching our vocation. That's just as well. Better to be selective than wasteful. Browsing was enough to scratch the itch, in my case. Say, have you seen any statues about? Solid stone ones, carved in the likeness of monsters. Tell is, quite a number of them were found not long ago, just west of the Agamemnon ruins. Here's the curious part, though. The things look damn near real. So real, in fact, that collectors were willing to pay outlandish sums of gold for him. Would that I'd gotten my hands on one. Suppose I'll just have to hope there are more of them out there somewhere. The ruins. Hold on. I think we passed some ruins. Crumbling ruins. Hmm. Now I'm really curious. I don't know where that is. That he was talking about, that is. Welcome and well, as a discerning customer like yourself will doubtless appreciate, do come again. I want to switch my vocation. Where can I go to do that? There we go. So lost in this place. We pawns are mere travelers from beyond the rift. What cause have the Batali to regard us with such hostility? Take heart. But we are fulfilling our duty at the Arisen side. We have naught to be ashamed of. I agree, Lucy. Go on, have a look. Hoy, looking to change. No need to overthink it. You can change it. Well, got any findings? Dousing spikes. Yeah. Mystic spear hand. Let's try this out. This one looks really freaking cool.
We'll put those in our chest. Pleasure doing business with you. A mystic spear hand. What a Greetings, Sir Arisen. I have a message for you. Sir Manella would speak with you in the palace. Pray seek her out at your earliest convenience. Holy moly, everybody is literally talking to me in this place. Like, I can't step two feet without somebody stopping me and saying, Oh, hey, we need your help, or blah, 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 blah. My services don't come cheap. Yeah, well, hopefully it's not too expensive. Ooh, that looks really cool. Super expensive, though. Mind. Come again when you've more coin. Me? I s now, this hardly bears saying, but don't... Helmet. That definitely is not my jam. That looks pretty cool. That looks pretty cool, too. Let's see, Lucy, do you... Ooh, yeah, that looks pretty awesome. put that on and then I don't think we can afford anything else for Lucy yeah we're gonna be out of money so we'll we'll get what we can don't you dare Try to take anything without always a pleasure. Interested in my wares? Now let's go put some stuff away. I think our house is this way. You can see it on the mini map. The secret to my lustrous coat. I shall never tell. Suffer so. Put that away, that away, that, that, and that. Now let's rest. And we'll go back and try to talk to, um, whatever his name is. Hugo, I think his name is. We must rest. Though the sun... Ooh, she killed a Cyclops. Don't have enough gold to be giving anybody, unfortunately.
Let's give somebody Sure, we'll do that. To this world I return, ready to put all I've learned to use. Now we've the vim to tackle the day ahead. Come. 755 rift crystals. Underway. Nice. Let's go talk to Hugo, see if he's got anything to tell us. Wonder how good this spear hand is. I'm very curious. Have no fear, master. I'll fare all right without you for a little while. That's why I did the thing, and I don't believe for a moment. Greetings, sir. You hear about the whelp, I presume. I. I've not forgotten our arrangement, but I'm afraid things aren't going as smoothly as I'd hoped. It's my superiors, you see. They understand that there are some extenuating circumstances, but the lad's still a thief. They're not convinced he should be released so soon. Normally, I'd let the matter lie, but methinks I could find the courage to try again with only a little motivation. What say you, sir? Have you any words of encouragement for me? Son of a bitch. I think this guy is ripping me off, but we'll do it again. Aye, that's just what I needed to hear. I'll see about securing the lad's release anon. You really must care for the whelp to go so far for him. Let's hope he's worth it, eh? Yeah, take my gold, fool. That's why I did the thing, and I don't believe from. I hate how he has nothing else to say when we're sitting here buying his freedom. Let's rest Good. again. You return. I find myself on edge when you stray from my line of sight. Running back and forth, back and forth. At least I'll learn, um, at least I'll learn the layout of Batal, or Bak Batal. I think it's called Bak Batal. I go in the wrong house. I think I went in the wrong house. Reckon I'd spend my life here if I could. Here's my house. Shall we get some rest then? Should we hunt a few monsters to start the day off? Come, we've much to be getting on with. Feeling rested, I trust? Interested in my words? I'm in no hurry to leave. I don't have well enough of these gluttonous pests. Go back to the top here. How can I get this colour to come out brighter? Think of misfortunes and make pleasant. The hours seem to fly when I'm here. 
I wonder what's down that way. I kind of want to go down there after we do this quest for Hugo. I keep wanting to call him, uh, shit. Now I can't even think of his name. Never mind. He's Hugo now. I see a rift stone over here. Cool beans. I've just had a thought. Loath as I am to recall the events of the coronation, they are fresh in my mind still. How might the technique used to control us be dispelled? Do you know how long you'll be? I only asked so that I might adopt the most effective stance to recuperate my strength. It is not our place to hurry the Arisen. No, there's no need to fret. These things take time, you understand. No, there's... Do you have anything new to say? That's why I did the things I... And I don't no, I didn't think so. Alright, well, I guess we will go... in that little cove or whatever that I was just talking about. We'll go explore that. I'm not going to keep running back and forth, back and forth. I mean, I will. I mean, I will if I have to, but let's explore a little bit. upon this old method just want to know what's down here looks like the coast this place offers a view of the sea I imagine we would not escape a plunge into the water's depths there's Vernworth way over there. Press the wrong button. Come to think of it, different masters favor different pawns. One whom I served preferred to have bistrons for allies. Fascinating. Look at these things. Freshly rested as we are. They're like Saurians, but stone. Oh, I was trying to hit R1 to dodge. That's hilarious. Damn, Lucy. Messing him up. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I feel like that's a little too OP. I might have to... Get rid of that pawn. I mean, it's awesome and all, but I don't want it to be too overpowered. And things become a little that pointless because... No sense letting the enemy Ow. The upper hand. Because the pawn is... Completely annihilating it with the meteor strike. Oops, I did not mean to get off of it. Bring it on, Griffin. Damn it. Come on down.
try to take out its wings. Oh, holy shit. Yeah, Meteor Strike is definitely OP. I mean, it completely annihilated the Griffin. So Ada is awesome. I love her as a pawn, but I have a feeling we might have to get rid of her. And it's only because she's a little too overpowered. But I shall be ready to render aid at a moment's notice. We did get a vocation upgrade. So that is a plus. Ow. Twisted Pinion? It was a glorious success. Would that we might always be so in step, eh? Come on, folks. Let's kill the harpy. I'm not sure these are harpies, to be honest. Ooh, what's this? Small blue crystal shard. Who are you? Uh, no, n never mind. It is of little import. I'm searching for blue crystal shards. Find any and I'll pay you handsomely. The bigger they are, the higher your reward will be. Well, I have one regular one. Is that all? Tiny fragments such as these aren't nearly good enough. Still, I expect I'll find a use for them. Here, take your coin and be gone. What is this? Tis a god's sway. Well, to be precise, the crystalline substance from which tis made. By refining such crystals, anyone can attain the power of the Arisen. The power to command pawns, that is. However, small fragments are meaningless. They cannot contend with the Arisen's power, you see. Speaking of which, should you find any large fragments, bring them to me, won't you? Though that might be difficult, we've scoured this area quite thoroughly, I should think. It is possible larger shards may have been mistaken for jewels and carried off by scavengers or collectors or some such. Mayhap one such as the Oracle or the Dragonforged would be able to aid you in locating them. I can tell you no more than that. The Dragonforged? Pretty sure in Dragon's Dogma 1 there was a Dragonforged too. Before I forget, the pawns in this party are women all. And yet, no two of us are the same. Gee, thanks. I really do hope they patch that to where the pawns just don't talk as much, or there's a slider to make them talk less. Obviously, there's a reason for them to talk. They definitely help out on certain occasions but when you're hearing the same dialogue over and over and over again it gets pretty old pretty fast I think we're gonna end soon The Arisen comes. Is this meeting also by the dragon's design? Trade items? 
Oh, we can... Oh, I don't have... What is WLC? Oh, we can get a ton of fairy stones that way. Unmaking arrow? Oh. That's freaking cool. Enhanced equipment. Is this how we dragon forge stuff? Let's talk to him. You may be pitted against the dragon, yet its fate is yours to share. Tell me of the dragon. The dragon is the embodiment of destructive force. Though this does not mean that it is evil. Understand this. The concepts of good and evil are mortal inventions. And thus cannot be applied to the dragon. It is a being of a higher order. As are ye. Now that the dragon has marked ye. Setting ye apart from your fellows. Tell me of the Arisen. The Arisen is a transcendent beam, always chosen by the dragon. It marks for itself the individual who must fell it. Thus, when the dragon is made manifest, so too is an Arisen. And should that Arisen fall, another shall rise in their place. The cycle is doomed to continue till the dragon is felled. For that is what the will of this world has ordained. And what does it mean to be dragon forged? I am the husk of he who was once arisen. My final battle against the dragon culminated in the loss of the will that should have seen me bring the creature low. Thus, as the Arisen is defined by the strength of their will. From that moment on, I was Arisen no longer. Such is the world's will. I dare say it compels me e'en now to impart upon ye all the knowledge I possess. What is the Godsway? The Godsway? Forgive me. But I've ne'er heard of such a thing. However, some years past, a sorcerer of Batal came to me seeking knowledge of the dragon, just as ye have. Faces, sir, I believed he called himself. It appeared his intent was to alter the will of the world through mortal means. Perhaps there is some connection. Do you know where the dragon is? Ye need not seek the dragon. It will find ye. Aye, make no mistake. The dragon will appear before ye when the time is come. Still, I suppose I can tell ye about a rumor I heard the other day. Apparently, a dragon was sighted in Harv Village, though I am not sure I believe it. After all, now that he had been marked as a risen, the dragon ought next appear before ye at the appointed time. So it stands to reason that e'en if a creature of draconic aspect and destructive powers did appear in that village, was no dragon. A mockery of one, perhaps, but not the dragon true. What are worm life crystals? The substance of which ye speak is formed of crystallized droplets of dragon blood. Worm's life crystals can be obtained not only from the true red dragon, but from lower drakes as well. They retain a measure of draconic power. And when used correctly, 
will bestow upon ye powers that eclipse the will of this world. Well, thank you for your time. I don't have any more questions. Then go. But visit me again when ye have spilled draconic blood. Since times of eld, dragon blood has been used to refine all manner of equipment. I myself learned the art by deciphering ancient texts. Remember, draconic blood flows through the veins of lesser drakes as well. Bring me what ye reap, and I shall harness it to your benefit. Then I bid ye farewell. No purchases to be made today, I see. I just hope the shopkeep understands. The Arisen is ever prudent in the application of coin. I'll read that stuff on my own time. Rift incense? I don't know about you, Master, but I'm worn out. Mightn't we have a rest before pressing on? I think what we're going to do is kill that rat. I want to go up here and kind of check what's over here. Looks like we can it's go up and explore. On, you say, Master? This is all stuff that we have not explored. Probably going to explore a lot of this stuff um, off recording, including going up here and exploring this. I still have not explored all of that. But for now, I think right here is a good spot to end the video. I want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by. Hopefully you all enjoyed watching the video. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night. Whatever time it may be in your part of the world, Mr. John Wayne, signing off.